What's up guys? Today we're going to be talking about how to make passive income for your subscription box or e-commerce business using email marketing. Email marketing is by far one of my absolute favorite channels to grow your business, make money, and literally make money when you're doing other things like going to the beach, walking your dogs, playing with your kids. So let's dive into it and I'm going to walk you through how to set up a workflow in Klaviyo, which is my favorite email marketing software for product-based businesses. And I'm just going to give you a couple examples of the type of workflows that you need to set up for your business. So let's dive in. Hey guys. All right. So we're going to walk through how to make passive income for your product-based business. And we're going to be focusing on email marketing and what is called a welcome sequence. And now I'm going to explain how this all works. So this is Clavio. This is my favorite email marketing for a product, e-commerce, subscription box. It's by far the best one and it's very powerful. So let's go through what this looks like. So how this works, someone goes to your website and they go and they sign up for your pop-up, which is something like take 20% off your first order, drop your name and your email, right? Or they're going to go down to something like have a newsletter opt-in. So here is for Patrick Pet is a newsletter opt-in right here. So let's be friends, take 10% off, join our VIP, da -da 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 -da, drop your email below. So when someone drops their email to your website, so your pop-up, your opt-in, etc., you then have to send them emails. You have to nurture them so they can learn about your business. They can learn about your products. They can learn about you and you push them to use that discount code. So this is what's called a welcome sequence. So it's a series of emails that someone will receive when they sign up or opt in for your newsletter or your pop-up. So here's how it looks behind the scenes. So we go to Klaviyo and honestly, you can use any email marketing that you use. You know, a lot of my clients or students use Flowdesk. Um, Flowdesk is okay. It can, um, connects with Shopify. It's not as powerful as Klaviyo, but it, it, it works. You know, there's MailChimp. I don't like MailChimp and it doesn't work well with Shopify anymore, but whatever you use is great. Just use something and you want to go and create a workflow. Different platforms call them different things. Some call them sequences, automations, or workflows, whatever that would be. So in Klaviyo, it's called a flow. So you would go and click create flow. And I'll show you what ours looks like after I have an example here for this pet business. It's called welcome series, but let's just look at it from scratch. So you'd click create flow and then Klaviyo is great because they have a lot of different templates you can use. So depending on what your goals are, you can just use one of their templates. So let's assume this is going to be a subscriber welcome. Let's see what it looks like. So in Klaviyo, because it's very powerful, you can do a lot of segmenting. What that means is like very specific things for specific people based on what they do. So for example, there's a welcome series for customers versus non-customers. So if someone has already purchased from you, but they join a new opt-in that you have, they would get a different series of emails versus someone who's not purchased from you. Today, I want to keep it simple. I don't want you to do anything crazy. I just want you to send something. So I'm going to just go with this basic welcome series standard. It tells you the description, it gives you the name, and then you would click trigger. So the trigger is going to be likely like a newsletter or a pop-up or something like that. So the trigger just means when someone does something. So right here, when someone subscribes to newsletter, depending on where these people are coming from, like the, the detonation point would be the opt-in like that I showed you right here, right? So whatever that would be, you would click that. But let's get started on what this looks like on the inside. So let's just pretend we're gonna create a workflow. And again, you can do this on any platform that you're using, honestly. Here's the back end of what it would look like. So it comes with three emails here. Um, I like to do four to five emails in my welcome sequence. So do whatever is good for you, honestly. Um, and for anyone who's listening or watching, um, I have my course, the Slay and Scale Product Academy. It is launching again, the end of September. So depending on when this video airs or you watch this video, you can either sign up for my course or you can join the wait list for when it opens again. So I will drop the link below here, but I go through email marketing in my course. It's basically a, a course that's going to help a product-based business. So e-commerce or a subscription box business grow. Like it gives you the roadmap to grow your business. So if you're under $10,000, in sales per month, this course will be great for you. It's gonna give you everything from systems and foundations 
marketing and visibility, sales channels, and then how to create a community. And these are all things that I took from my own product-based business that I started, grew, and sold. And it's the framework that I, it's a unique framework that I've come up with for my clients and, and students and et cetera. So we dive into email marketing. I give you all my workflow templates. I give you everything about email marketing as one of the modules. So if you're interested, you want more help, then definitely sign up. So you would go here and then you would just basically click here and you'd start creating your email. So I'm not gonna give you like every step of the way here. I just wanna give you a high level strategic uh, view of how to create your workflows for your product-based business. For these emails, the biggest thing that you wanna do is you wanna have nurturing content. So you want to ask yourself, what do I need to include in my emails to get my to get these prospective customers to know, like, and trust my brand? So you want to have some emails that give a little bit about your business, like who are you? Here, it just gives you a very basic template. So what you want to do in here is just go in, you would click edit content. And Clavio is not like the look and feel of some of the emails isn't always the best, but it does its job. It's good enough, you know? Um, so you would come here and you would just start kind of playing around with this stuff. So say you were like, no, I don't, I don't like that image or I want to put a different image down here. You would drop the image thing. Um, the most important thing I want you to think about here is what do I have to say in these emails to get someone to know more about, to get to know my brand more, get to know more about my best selling products and anything else they need to know. So for your first email, it's gonna be like, thank you for joining our email list. Um, you know, our brand is, insert your like mission statement or something interesting about your business, right? Then it would be something like, you know, we love to insert something about your business. Like for this company, we love to spoil dogs with our fun and cute dog toys, you know? Something interesting about your business. Don't forget to take your 20% off. Here's your coupon code. So that's the biggest thing for the first email is you're just saying, thanks for signing up. Here's a little bit about us that you need to know. Here's your discount code. That's the most important thing that you need for that email. So I'm going to save this. And if you do want to use Clavio, Clavio has a million really great training tools. So if you do sign up for it, they really have a lot of videos that teach you how to edit these emails and things like that. So I'm really here focused on the more strategic side, like, why you need these emails and what they can do for you. So you would create this email and then you would open up the next email basically. Okay. So then you would open up and once you're done with the email and it looks great, you would then click here and click live and that's it. So then this one, so welcome series two. follow us on social media. So I love this I think this is going to be great. So again, for this welcome sequence, literally like three to five emails with different objectives for each email. So the first email is, welcome to our family. Here's a little bit about us. The second email could be something like, so for this template, they say, follow us on social media. So that's great. If you wanna do that, I think that's a great email to do. So you would edit that, you'd go back. So once you do your emails, again, if you're like, I have no idea what to say, just keep it simple. A little bit about your business, a little bit about you. Who's the person behind the business? That could be one of your emails. You can have an email that says, follow us on Instagram, follow us on TikTok, wherever you hang out or your customers hang out, do that. You want your welcome flow or welcome series, I would say over the course of like a week, a week and a half. So if you have five emails, I'd spread them out over about a week and a half. You don't want too much time in between because then people kind of forget about you. You want, you want your business to be top of mind. And my best advice here is, give a reminder for the discount code in every single email and whatever your last email is add urgency like today's the last day to use your discount code click here so that's kind of the setup of of your welcome flow so once you set this up you would you know make sure everything's live and click save and then what you're going to see now is that you will start making money off of these emails maybe in your business right now you have like one email that goes out and just says, welcome to our newsletter. Here's your discount code. Like it's boring. There's no personality and you haven't nurtured that person. Just because someone signs up for your email list does not mean they're ready to buy from you. So by adding this welcome flow, you're, you're allowing that person to get to know you. And hopefully by the end they do buy from you. And if they don't, well, they may need more time to learn about you. But those are the kind of things that you want to include in your welcome sequence. You want to build the like, know, and trust for your business. 
So whatever kind of information you feel is important for people to learn about you, that's what you want to put in your welcome sequence. This is literally how you make passive income for your business is you have, and again, today we're just focusing on the welcome ser series. There are a lot of other automations that you can add to your email marketing strategy, like cart abandonment, post purchase emails, win back. I mean, there's so many things. I love email marketing. So again, if you're interested in learning more about email marketing, join me in my course, the Slay and Scale Product Academy. It's gonna be amazing. We just wrapped up our first launch of it. We had about 30 people inside. Amazing feedback, amazing social proof, amazing results that people are getting. And it actually, email marketing has been one of the pieces of the course that people have liked the most. So that makes me happy. If you are interested in learning more, click the link in the notes below and you can learn at least learn more about the course and see if it's good for you. If you guys love this video, be sure to check out my new course, the Slay and Scale Product Academy. It's gonna be the last week in September. We open cart for a couple days and it's going to be one of the best courses if you are a product-based business e-commerce subscription box it's going to give you all the tools the roadmap to grow your business if you're making under ten thousand dollars per month this course is for you so be sure to sign up for it and you can link it below all right see you guys next week